SOM is a multi-service organization, a nonprofit in Washington, D.C. that's been in existence for over 40 years. We have multiple lines of business. What we're most known for is our dining room and a medical clinic, dental clinic, behavioral health, recovery services, affordable housing, psychiatric care, and then an employment training center as well as senior services. The Center for Employment Training has been funded by the Workforce Collaborative through the uh, Community Foundation, the National Capital Region, for about four years through the AAI initiative to help us to build up our adult basic education program and to help our participants in our program to track into post-secondary or career readiness and or college. And some was really good in understanding exactly what we were looking for. We're looking for sort of mature young men who can make a commitment and but also showed leadership potential. I think the secret sauce in, in the SUM program is you take sort of a whole life approach. It's impressing upon them the importance of punctuality, reliability. They come to the job understanding the fundamentals. Uh, my name is Thomas Hughes. I'm, I graduated from CET uh, 2015. Before SUM, I was uh, in and out of jobs. Really, was in and out of jail, to be honest. Uh, I had too many uh, run-ins with law enforcement. I talked to a friend who graduated from some. And here I am. Life is challenging, you know, for all of us. Having a job, having income, and the importance of saving and, and investing and health care, it becomes really daunting, and I, some is a place for them to go to get answers. With the adult basic ed integration, the gains that we've seen for our learners has been within the first three months of training that folks are making 67 percent increases in their educational functioning level. So if folks are starting at a fifth grade level, within three months they're already at a seventh grade level. And this is double what the state average and expectation is. It's allowed us to also build up some of our retention services. So as soon as they secure employment, every 30 days we meet with them one-on-one -on -one in their workplace and talk to their employers to let them know that we're here to support them through that first year of employment. Uh, we're seeing amazing results from that. So those who graduate in secure employment, 87% of those are keeping a job for a year directly because of the support we're able to give them. Well, uh, some taught me a lot uh, how to open up and talk because that was my hardest thing and how not to be a firecracker because I had that's a very bad attitude problem before I came. And it told me discipline because in the first 10 days here, if you're not here at 8.30, then you're just out. <laughs> We're working with folks who have felonies, misdemeanors, have been victims of domestic violence, have multiple years of incarceration, significant mental health conditions, um, may have learning disabilities. Really folks who the universe have said, Either we can't work with you or we won't work with you. Um, and what we've really said is, no, that's exactly who we want to serve. Like I said, I just came from prison. I had nothing. And some was willing to accept and look past all my background, get it fixed, and look for the future. This takes a large population of individuals who are district residents. This is their home. And we say, we care. It's helping me support my family. It's too much that go into it. So I'm not just working for me working for everybody around me. I want to see you make the best version of yourself come to life. And I'm really fortunate because I get to be a part of that with them every day.